Would you like to learn the next 100 to 1000 X AI cryptocurrency gems with the potential to turn $1,000 into 100,000, if not a million dollars? I believe the next bull market is going to be the most vicious bull market we have ever seen, seeing a market cap of upwards of $15 trillion. And this is happening in conjunction with the evolution of AI. So I'm going to be ranking all of these AI projects for their multiplier potential in the next bull market and identify for you what are the best investments you can make in the field of AI. My name's the Supo Man, your superhero of 100 to 1000 X gems. I have found some of the best cryptocurrencies that exist today before they were famous and I am very confident I am going to quadruple this list by the end of 2025. So if you love content like this, just be sure to smash that like button. It helps me a great deal more than you can imagine. And also hit the subscribe button so that you don't miss out on alpha that comes from me, the Supo man who's been in cryptocurrency for seven years. So I'm just gonna get straight into the action because there's a lot of AI projects to cover. My research has shown me that AI projects are amongst the best performers when there is a bull narrative. And looking at how AI projects have performed across the year, this has been one of the only niches where you've been able to get over 100x in a bear market. The coins that did the best had super low market caps in a bull trend. The ones that had huge market caps, i.e. Singularity Net had arguably one of the biggest market caps, that only did a 13x. As usual, nothing I say is to be construed as financial advice. Crypto is largely unregulated and high risk and people who invest should be prepared to lose all their money. And everything I see to you in this video is for informational and educational purposes only. Singularity Net, one of the original AI cryptocurrencies. These guys are behind Sophia, the robot AI that replicates a human. Now, what Singularity Net is, is they are a marketplace for AI-based dApps, and the Singularity token is the universal coin that unites all of those dApps. Its volume is on par with its market cap. Its market cap is near half a billion dollars. So as far as I'm concerned, from here, Singularity could do a 10 to 20x. Fetch AI is a decentralized AI open network. You can use the tools provided by Fetch to create layer ones, to create DeFi, to create dApps in the AI space. This was launched on Binance, just like Matic, and Matic went on to do a 1000x. And Fetch AI, being an original cryptocurrency, when people think of AI, this is probably considered the Ethereum of the crypto landscape. It's currently ranked 103 on CoinMarketCap, but the volume is the 55th most traded cryptocurrency out of 50,000 cryptocurrencies. That being said, considering its high market cap, I would still say that Fetch AI is likely to do a 10 to 20x from here. Render has been one of the best performing AI-based cryptocurrencies in this bear market. And what Render is, is it allows you to buy and rent GPU computational power for your project and rendering technology. Now, I personally think that Render also has a 10x capability in this bull market. I believe it's already had its dramatic rise in cryptocurrency. Many of the YouTubers have already spoken about Render, so I think there's only so far this cryptocurrency will go in the next bull market. Bitenzor is considered the Bitcoin of AI because it creates a open neural network. It utilizes and leverages the power of all participants' computers to build a data and intelligence network. Now, Tau has already had a violent explosion in this bear market, going from $40 literally two months ago to over $300. Bitensor has performed extremely well. It was a cryptocurrency that I covered before anybody knew about it, but Given that, I believe Bitensor now has a 10 to 20x ahead of it, but I don't see it going to 25. Bad Idea AI is another decentralized AI platform. With this, they have got an intellectual chatbot and they help deploy apps on the Shibarium network. And this is a big reason why this flew 
earlier in the year and has retraced down a lot. It's now worth 17 million. I would say this one doesn't get a lot of hype because it's not considered one of the mainstay cryptocurrencies. But when an AI season comes in, I do imagine it's going to take this rather high. But I would say because of its ties with the Shibarium and because this is a newer AI play and it's a lower market cap, this has got the potential for 25x. Cortex is a decentralized layer one blockchain that utilizes AI for dApp building. Now this one has been around since 2018. This, like Singularity and Fetch, has been around a long time. This has achieved a peak market cap of 314 million, and it's got insane volume for its market cap. But this is an older coin. My personal prediction is Cortex could do a 10x. It's a lower market cap, but it is an old coin. It is on Binance, so it does mean it's going to get a lot of liquidity, but I don't think anybody really talks about Cortex. So I don't think it's going to be one of the big multipliers for the next bull market. A cash network has recently surged in value, being up around its high point of near $2. A cash network is a Cosmos-based cloud computing super cloud, but it utilizes AI within its technology, hence it's considered an AI play. Now the volume, actually puts this at 486, considering this is near the top 100. It's within the cloud computing area. So it's two narratives, cloud computing and AI. And it's relatively new. I would say that a cash network has got the potential to do a 10x, maybe a 20x in the next bull market. Artificial liquid intelligence to me is one of the best modern AI plays. This is not only a network to create dApps for developers, they are creating their own proprietary dApps. One of them being character AI, where you can generate a character with a likeness to what you want. It can look like a celebrity, it can look like you, it can look like a family member. And it is designed to think intuitively like an AI bot with super intelligence. And they've got another product, which is where they actually give life to NFT. So if you own a board ape or a crypto punk, then you can turn that into a living, talking, fighting machine. So I personally believe artificial liquid intelligence has got greater multiplier potential, particularly because it's new and never been in a bull market. I would say that this has 50x potential. ChainGPT is another new AI cryptocurrency that is more modern focused. So you can use ChainGPT to create AI-based smart contracts, AI-based generative art. It's got a launch pad attached to it, but this will allow you to use AI to be able to read charts, to be able to do analysis of crypto news that gives you really good insights into the crypto market. I personally believe that ChainGPT, because of its low market cap, this has got excellent potential. I think this can do a 25 to 50x. Arb Doge or AI Doge is a relatively new project that launched in 2023 and it covers three narratives, AI, memes, and the Arbitrum network. So it's got three reasons why this can pump. The volume of this puts this in the top 300, but the market cap puts this outside, well outside, the top 500. So this has got excellent potential because it hits three narratives. Now what AI Doge is, is it is a meme coin that unites people that are passionate about AI and they are building AI projects as part of the ecosystem to give it some intrinsic value. I would say that AI Doge has got the potential to do a 25x. I don't necessarily think this is super explosive. It's not a mega brand within meme coins, but I think it could do well because it's got an AI focus. Magical AI was a project that launched out of AIPad, the only project that have launched out of AIPad. Now, it presently is $29,000 in market cap with $29,000 in volume. So the volume is on par with the market cap. Now, this one is a very degenerative crypto play. This allows you to create NFT collections based on AI. So you give it a prompt, you say what you want to design, it will design these NFTs for you, which are unique, and then you can sell them as an NFT collection. It's a great idea. However, where my problem for Magical AI is, is if you use the website and connect your wallet, you can't actually produce anything. Now, in my opinion, this will be one that could, it could have been abandoned, 
or they could come alive when a bull market is confirmed and this one can do anything from zero going absolutely nowhere to doing a 100x. So I'm going to put this in the equidistant category as a degen play. It's extremely high risk, but it could do extremely well just simply because there is a shortage of AI coins in this whole ecosystem that are low cap and are modern. Clintex is an AI based cryptocurrency blockchain designed for the pharma industry and for clinical trials. Now this one has been around a long time. To me, it's a super duper degen cryptocurrency. It's 3 million in market cap. Its volume is actually higher than its market cap ranking, but I personally think this is a real degen play. I don't believe in this one at all, but Looking at how Demetra did, which is an AI-based technology for the farming industry, it wouldn't surprise me if this had another run and potentially did a 25x just purely because of where its market cap is and because of osmosis. There are not many AI cryptocurrencies considering the grandioseness of the narrative. So therefore, it could pump Clintex to 25x, or this could go absolutely nowhere and be a 5x. Viot stands for Virtual Assistant Internet of Things. So it is what it says it is. It's an AI-based virtual assistant. It's a bit like ChatGPT. You give it a command, you give it a question, it gives you an answer. It acts as your assistant, as it were. Now again, this one has been around a while. It's been around since 2021. It has been part exposed to a bull market already. Now, this one has got terrible volume considering its market cap. However, this is one of those degen plays that people like in an AI trend. So I would say that Via has got the potential to do a 25x. AI pad is a launch pad for AI projects. This coin itself did a 66x on launch and has come right back down. Its first IDO did a 40x. By getting into AIPad, you got a multiplier, and getting into the launch that came out on AIPad, you got a multiplier. Now, AIPad is going to be bringing out a new cryptocurrency called Zybot, and Zybot is a Telegram trading bot that has AI technology in it, and you need AIPad in order to be able to get into that cryptocurrency. But as you can see, it's massively down on its all-time high. It's a super-duper low-cap cryptocurrency. So as far as I'm concerned, this one is high risk, high reward. This one I see as doing 100x simply because launch pads do so well in a bull market. Everybody wants to get in on pre-sales. Everybody wants to get in before a project 100 or 1000 X's. And to be able to do that, you need to get in at a launch pad. And AI pad is specifically concentrated on AI projects and is the brainchild of Bluezilla who were responsible for most of my best gains in the last bull market, such as Meta VPad, which was a 1260X. So therefore, I think the AI pad taps slap bang into the demand for new projects that boast more modern AI technology. Ocean Protocol is a big data cryptocurrency project that uses AI for data sorting and data analysis. So what you can do with Ocean Protocol is you can buy, sell, and use data that is stored on this platform. So if you are wanting to build the next big data platform or, or the next chat GPT, then this will be where you can buy data, put it into a DAP and be able to have AI sort it so that it creates a chat GPT for you. So as far as I'm concerned, Ocean Protocol is a supreme project. Now, its market cap and volume is around about on par. I would say this is an exceptional project. But again, it's very, very high in market cap. I would say this one has a maximum the opportunity to 25x. PAL is one of the big success stories of modern AI. This only came out a few months ago, and a few months ago, it was 404713, and today it's 14 cents. So this one has already made mega money and is a 109 million market cap. Now, these guys are known for quite a few things, but they are an advanced chatbot built on AI technologies designed to streamline tasks that typically require human intellect such as natural language understanding, image recognition, decision making, and problem solving. And they incentivize hodlers with profit sharing and token buybacks to drive token demand and price. This is a reason why people have been super bullish on it. And these guys have partnered up with a lot of Telegram projects recently. Telegram bot projects are incorporating PAL's AI capabilities to make a better product for their DAP. As a result of that, it's going to drive more demand for PAL. Having said that, I would say that PAL has only really got 25x at maximum 
from where it is now because it's already done super well and it's already attracted a load of money. Grok is a recently created meme coin designed specifically to exploit the popularity of Elon Musk's chatbot Grok. So he has created Grok essentially to be like ChatGPT, his own ChatGPT. And people bought into this to exploit that narrative. So every time that Elon Musk tweets about Grok, then it will naturally give some more value to the Grok meme coin. There's quite a few Grok meme coins. This is the main one. Now, apparently it's diluted market cap is 105 million because they don't have a circulating supply listed here. Now, that would still make the volume over a two to one ratio. So this is very relevant right now, but this has only come out within the last month and there are a load of fake Groks trying to eat into the market share that the main Grok can achieve. Now, I personally believe that the Grok meme coin from a market cap of 100 million can't really travel too high. I would say a 25x at best, but this is only because of the success of Flocky in the last bull market. Just because Elon Musk bought a Shiba Inu that he named Flocky, and that absolutely soared. So as a result of that, Grog can do possibly the same. I would say that 25X is its absolute maximum for multipliers. The graph is an indexing tool that came out in 2020. It's been around a while already. And as far as I'm concerned, this has got one of the most tenuous links to AI. Really, it's an indexing tool, and they've only started releasing some AI functionality. So where a lot of the dApps and DEXs in cryptocurrency, how they get their price data is through the graph. So the graph has quite a monopoly on the top crypto projects, like, for instance, PancakeSwap. Now, as far as I'm concerned, this is a really weak AI play, and this is already 1.3 billion in market cap. I personally am not a huge fan of the graph, and I would say it's a 10x at best. I would actually put it more at 5x. 0x0.ai is a relatively recent project that is focused on privacy. So it focuses on privacy with advanced AI-based safety tools and a unique revenue sharing model. So this can be used in the DeFi landscape. So this is basically AI, privacy, DeFi, and also ZK proofs by the look of it. Now, this is 95 million in market cap with 718,000 in volume. I personally think this is one of the most overvalued projects that exists today. And I would say that this is likely to fetch a 10 to 5x. Ori Chain is actually a quite exciting layer one blockchain that utilizes AI to maximize and optimize security of dApps built with Ori Chain and dApps are able to incorporate AI into their functionality. So this is quite a grand scope cryptocurrency that in my opinion is actually quite underlooked in my opinion. So this is a 64 million market cap with a 3.5 million volume. Volume is roughly on par with its market cap, but it's a layer one AI project. But what I would say stands in the way of Ori Chain is this has already had its first hype cycle and it went to a valuation of $102. Do I think it can achieve that again? It's very, very rare a cryptocurrency does exceed its previous all-time high. Having said that, there has never been an AI narrative other than in 2023 ever in cryptocurrency. So the fact it went to $100 is actually, I think, a marvel considering. So I would say the Ori chain has got the potential for a 25 to 50x. I'm going to put it 25x to be conservative. Zybot is not yet launched, but this is going to be the next launch on AIPad. This is a Telegram bot that uses AI for trading and for popularity of coins and to be able to find out what are the trending narratives and what are coins you should be speculating on. So this is a very interesting AI-based project that is going to be launching out of AIPad and is a Bluezilla project. The last Bluezilla project, which was an image generation based cryptocurrency, that did a 40x. This one is more on trend because it's AI and it's Telegram bots, which has done very, very well with the likes of Aimbot and Unibot and Profit Bots has done extremely well. So I would say that Zybot has got the potential to do a 50 to 100x on launch, depending on what the market circumstances look like. ProfitBots has been my most profitable investment in 2023 so far. This is a Telegram trading bot. 
it enables you to be able to find coins before they get famous. The tagline is, don't miss out on the next Pepe. And so far, Profit has stuck true to its word. It has managed to get multiple 100Xs, and these guys use AI technology to find the best cryptocurrencies to invest in and to enter and exit a price without having to do anything. So I think that Profit Bots has still got enormous potential because the Auto Sniper has only recently been released. This one has got the potential to do a 25 to 50x from here. Cubic Network is a recent AI project. It is basically AI mixed with proof of work layer one. So this is looking to be like the AI based Casper, where it's a proof of work blockchain that utilizes AI based mining. Now, the price action on Cubic is suggesting this has had a very, very recent hype and it has come down 2x since then. I would say this one is kind of designed as a bit of a meme coin more than anything else because it's got so many zeros attached to it. So I would say that Cubic has got the potential for a 25x only because it's so new. This has only come out in the past month. So this has not even really realized a lot of attention. So it's degenerative, but like I said, there's nothing really in the, in the way of metrics for this token. So I will put it at 25X. Layer AI is a very interesting project. It's presently just over 2 million in market cap. And what they do is they are a layer two data network. So what they do is they act as a layer two for Ethereum and they are able to collect a load of data information from the Ethereum blockchain and be able to package it with AI models. And these guys have got more products since their launch, such as Layer, VPN, and a data economy app. So these guys are still in the very early stages. And I think that they have got a lot of potential. They do have a high volume considering its market cap. So I would say this one has got potential for profit making opportunity, but is kind of having to compete with a lot of projects in a similar field. It's not as well known as other projects and will struggle to get the visibility and therefore the volume needed to get multipliers. But with an AI narrative in a bull market, this could just go up purely on osmosis. So I would say this has got 25 to 50 X potential. Image generation AI was the big success story of this bear market. It is the biggest multiplier of all AI projects doing a 164X from the beginning of January to the end of February. It's a good modern take on AI because what you can do with this is you can give it a prompt to create an image, all right? So you can make it create an original image on anything that you give it. So it's a lot like a lot of the very good AI image generation technology out there like DALI, like Night Cafe, and this is a 34 million market cap, and it had its majority pump at the beginning of the year. I would say that from where it is right now, this could probably still do a 25x, but probably not much more than that, because there's going to be a lot of image generation dApps coming into the market, I believe. There's going to be newer and probably better than image generation AI. TokenFi is a cryptocurrency that's only recently come out, and it's part of the Flocky ecosystem. So Flocky is a meme coin. TokenFi is a project that really focuses on real world assets and tokenization, but they have an AI bias within their technology. Now this has got extremely high volume for its market cap. And I think that TokenFi can do very, very similar to what Flocky did. This could get into the billions. I am personally waiting for a better entry point but I think that TokenFi could do a 50x, could do 100x, just purely because a real world assets is one of the most exciting projects in real world assets. So I think that from here, it can do a 50x. Sherpley is a complete degen AI play. This is a social media marketing tool mixed with AI. So it utilizes AI to connect brands and social media personalities with their audiences and target the right audiences so that they can get better success with their content creation. It's very, very degenerative. So it's a $175,000 market cap with half a million in volume and is based on Binance Smart Chain. So what I would say Chirpley can do is a potential 100x or a potential zero. It is purely degenerative. I am going to put it in around about 25x to be equidistant. Matrix AI. I covered these guys in 2018 when they were actually relevant and they were working on the project. 
most recently is Pumps Have Come because it's got AI in the title and is one of those legacy AI cryptos. But as far as I'm concerned, these guys don't do anything anymore. So it's a Chinese AI based blockchain project. And I think the volume is indicative of where this fits in the market. It's not relevant anymore. It's a very, very old project. The only people that are bullish on it are, are true degens that don't really care about any of the data. Being a person that covered this before when it was actually relevant, I don't think that these guys are at all relevant anymore. And I would say this could probably do well from a multiplier perspective, but it shouldn't. I will put it around about 10, 5 to 10 X. Demetra, one of the most overhyped, oversubscribed, overvalued pieces of crap that exists in cryptocurrency. This is a farming blockchain that utilizes AI. I can't imagine a farmer ever using blockchain, knowing what a blockchain is, even going into understanding it, let alone adding anything to it. And I would say that the only thing that has made this somewhat relevant is the fact that they use AI technology. Otherwise, this to me is completely dead. I do not respect this coin at all. I don't believe it has any fundamental qualities. I think it's just pure, purely a degen play. It's purely powered by the degen community. But to me, it's a pile of shite. I actually will downgrade it to a 10x. So that completes my analysis of multipliers for these AI projects in the coming bull market. And what I will say is, is that this is just a snapshot of what exists today. In a bull market, you see new projects, you see better technologies, you see something that is more modern, a more modern take on AI. And what I would say is, is that looking at these AI projects, yes, they're great for speculation. There are only a few gems in here. So I would say AI pad, artificial liquid intelligence, chain GPT, token fi are ones that I would identify as real true undervalued gems at this point. And I believe the best technologies are actually going to be coming up in the next bull market and they are going to be able to enable you to make much better multipliers. What did you think of how I rated these AI projects for their multipliers? Are there any that I missed out? And what AI projects are you most excited about in the future? And do you even like AI projects? Till next time, people. I'm the Superman. You have been amazing. I'll see you next time. It is lights out. All out.